Everyone knows I love Netflix, and they have a new series. It's a social experiment asking 30 men and women to fall in love sight unseen. That's a fool. But it's, <laughs> <laughs> but it's appropriately called Love is Blind, mm -hmm. and we don't want to spoil it for anyone, but there are some success stories. Well, it's pretty interesting, and it brings up the question, is love truly blind? Could you fall in love with someone after only having conversations with your potential partner? Mm -hmm. You know, let's talk about it, ladies. Yeah. So, so wait, so this <laughs> show, I've never seen it. You guys were talking to me about it. Apparently, they're in separate rooms or pods just talking to each other, but they never lay eyes on each other. They have no clue what the other person looks like at all. Right, right. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Well, I say that it's just never going to work. Yeah, and, and I'm just being honest. <laughs> I'm here for me, that. Let me tell you why. Because, yes, personality and being compatible, you know, having things in common are important, but also the physicality, attraction to one another goes a long way in a relationship. Yes, As someone who's been with their husband 15 years, I can tell you that, yes, we have to be able to be friends, but there have been days that his looks have saved his life. Hello, Ooh. somebody. <laughs> Is anybody in here? My attraction to him has saved his life. You know what I mean? There have yeah. to be moments where when y'all go through hard times, so you can just say, get in here now. Exactly. Yeah. Just, take just, just take it out on him. Just take it out on him. I think it's wonderful how people can be like, oh, well, you know, we fell in love because we got to know each other, but you're not even getting to know each other like that. I mean, there's just one part, two part. Yeah, no. mm -hmm. You know, one fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. You can't blue do that fish. because if, when you come she out of that the pod, says she did. and I look at you, and I can't find anything <laughs> remotely attractive about you when I do that one up, one down. If, it, if, if you have beautiful teeth or something I, that might get me or something like that, but if it's just conversation, just because you sound like Billy Dean, I mean, you look like her. But let's talk <laughs> conversation. Like, yeah, let's really talk conversation. Conversation rules the nation. We know that. Yes. I mean, it's very important. Um, I have definitely saw where if I spent time with a gentleman on, over the phone mm -hmm. and we've talked for mm -hmm. hours on end, mm -hmm. that does bring us closer, yes. honestly. I mean, mm -hmm. I, I remember talking to this gentleman on the phone from mm -hmm. like 9 to 4. Okay. <laughs> 9, 8, that means 9 p.m. I get to 4 it. I mean, I get it. Yeah. For a that. number of days. Yes. And honestly, there was a level of attraction there mm -hmm. that drew me to him because I was, I think I was more enamored with the way he thought. Um, good thing about it, he was handsome. Okay. Yeah. But see, but that's so, different from being a pod. But, well, y'all. Well, you came up well, in that. Well, instance. here's the thing, because she, she also said she was talking to him. Is this a person I hooked you up with? Oh, girl, you gotta stop. Is this a person I hooked you up with? <laughs> anyway, anyway. Hey, so, stop. All right, to, let's get focused. Okay. But, let's get but focused. did it seal the deal? No. Because once you sat down with each other and you saw how attractive he was, that was like, oh, I can do this. Bonus. Right. But Bonus. talking to him got you interested. Right. Yes. What if, if he was a fool in the looks? Then it would have been. It was nice talking to you, but it's, I'm not ready for a relationship. Friend zone. See, yeah. my thing is this. Yeah. I'm 5'10". Okay, then. What if you come up out that pie and no shame, <laughs> but you a whole midget? I, no, no, right there, I'm out of here. A little person. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. You don't even have to be a real midget. Hold you could just be a midget on the look side. You could yeah. be five a feet. A little person. But in I'm 5'10". That's a midget to me. Because that's a midget to me. You see what I'm saying? Swag and style are very important, especially for stylistas, right? Like, you want to be able to go out with your man and know be, that and be you're proud of right. him. You, now, if he comes out of the pod and his both sides of his sneakers are touching because his no shoelaces are too tight. No man. You know These are Ooh. concepts that I can't, I can't do. do. If, yeah. Now, now, now I, I was talking to one of the producers, and okay. she watches it uh, profusely. She okay. really likes the series. Mm -hmm. And she said that one time the people came up out the pod, and they were real happy with each other, and they liked each other. They liked the way they looked, and then they went on ahead and got married and all of this, that, and the third. But then he going to say when they were, well, they didn't get married. They got engaged. She said oh, the man yeah. going to say when they was engaged, oh, just so, just so you know, I'm bisexual. That's my friend. That guy you're talking about is my friend. See, this is a fool. He is my and this friend. That's what I'm saying. That, so, that's, and he's, that a great, cool. he's a great guy. And I, you know, he and I talk about this all the time. He should have told her that in on the, the front inside end. The pie. He should have on the, the front pie. end. But I think he was so afraid. But I, I can tell you this, and I hope we have him on the show soon. He did say it was very freeing to do this show. So it definitely helped him. I told you you should have told the woman that on the front end. I ain't going to take yeah. your and, 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 and not only that. 
I could be talking on the phone with Egypt. Let's say I never seen Egypt. I've never seen her before, and and I'm I'm, I'm heterosexual. I have a husband and all of that. Mm -hmm. But I could be attracted to Egypt as a friend just from talking to her. Okay. So talking mm -hmm. is just not enough. Sometimes you need to see a yes. person's body yes. language when they're talking to you because then you can Agreed. determine yeah, if they're yeah, lying so, or not. So we've established that amongst us. Yes. But now I just want to throw something out there. Right. Be devil's advocate. Come right. on with the advocate. So for for many centuries, marriages were arranged it's by true. parents. Yes. yes. Where you you couldn't even see who you were marrying. Women would come down the aisle with something covering them. The what they That's uh -huh. where the veil came from. Mm -hmm. You didn't even see. You had to say I do before you saw her face mm -hmm. or you saw wow, the rest of her mess. body. Mm -hmm. And they stayed married forever. forever. You know, and it still happens in some parts of the it world. Does. And it, it works for some people. So maybe there is something. To well, it. that's because the financial yeah, piece. Yeah, the financial merger part. Now, let me tell you something. <laughs> I don't care how good you sound. Sometimes you, that coin make your face look right. You, 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 got, you got to have. Sometimes, sometimes you when you got a coin, you automatically you be fine. You be fine. Nah, you be fine. Nah, you be fine. Nah, you be fine. Nah, you be fine. You yeah. need some cattle and land, baby. Nah. <laughs> so, so at the end of the day, you can't just have a dog and a cat. Is love blind? It's, no. So does, can see. does this mean if you are were single, would you not date? Do uh, participate in online dating without pictures? Not without pictures. No, mm -hmm. because when somebody doesn't even put their picture up on a profile, That's, you think they're an axe murderer anyway. Like, oh what, do you have, what do you think they're married? What are you what hiding? hiding? Yeah. Even with online dating, you kind of see what you're getting. Yeah. Or you could be think too you young. Or you think you do much. because they can put up a fake picture. Mm -hmm. And so you could be underage too. Like you can tell when somebody's extremely young. Before well. we get out of here, I just well, I want to say this: If I was talking to somebody for like years and years and years, and we just developed something like you know the catfish people, I might be able to. Probably me not. So but like, if we'd love like to hear years. your thoughts on this subject. Send them over to Sister Circle TV up next.